Today we're working on a Yanmar VIO 35-3. This hose right here got pinched. Maybe it wore on the knuckle. Here's what the old line looked like. The old line got pinched in there. So it was leaking. I ordered some shims and I'm going to put some shims in here. And you're supposed to put them on, on this side, but that's for the thumb, I believe. But the shims are one and a half inner diameter, three and a quarter outer diameter. And depending on your thickness of the gap, you need to order them for that. I've already replaced this hose. To do that, you want to take off this little cover. After you do that, this thing right here rotates, but there's not enough room in here to get a wrench in here. So what you got to do is you got to pull this pin, unscrew this, that's a 18 millimeter, and then this pin comes out. I would suggest detaching your bucket with your quick disconnect. And once you do that, when you take this pin out, this arm swings forward and you got plenty of room to get in here with the wrench to unscrew that. And then you can take this part, it rotates all the way around so you can un undo the hose over here. That spacer is going to keep it from happening again. So I ordered these washers online, put them in here. And it seems to be working. The hose has not worn through or gotten back in here and pinched itself. So it's working. <laughs> 